Celebrity chef Mario Batali pleading not guilty to a charge of indecent assault and battery. A woman accused him of forcibly kissing and groping her at a restaurant back in 2017. He denies the accusation. Batali gave up ownership of his restaurants and other food businesses after several women accused him of touching them inappropriately. David Lee Miller reporting live from our New York newsroom. And David Lee, what more do we know? Trace, according to the criminal complaint, the woman took a photo of Batali with her cell phone while at a Boston bar. He told the woman to come here right now. The woman then apologized and offered to erase the photo. Batali then offered to take a selfie with the alleged victim. And that's when she says Batali pulled her closer, kissing her face and touching her breasts, buttocks and groin. The criminal complaint says, quote, the victim realized Batali was intoxicated by the smell and half-closed eyes. The victim stated she was uncomfortable and it was shocking to her that this was happening. The criminal court documents do not name the woman, but a civil suit filed in August resulting from the same alleged incident says she is 29-year-old Natalie Tenney. Her own lawyers issued a statement that reads in part, quote, Natalie is grateful the Suffolk County District Attorney's Office in Boston has chosen to go forward in prosecuting Mario Batali on criminal charges of sexually assaulting her. If convicted, Batali faces up to two and a half years behind bars. He would also have to register as a sex offender. Trace? David Lee, any word from Batali? During the uh, court appearance today, uh, Batali said barely a word. He kept a very low profile, or at least he tried to. Um, the court entered a not guilty plea on his behalf, and as he left, he ignored the questions that were being shouted uh, at him by reporters. An attorney representing Batali issued a statement saying, in part, Mr. Batali denies the allegations in both this criminal complaint and the civil complaint filed last August. The charges brought by the same individual without any new basis are without merit. At least four other women have accused Batali of inappropriate sexual behavior. The resulting controversy has cost him his television show and his lucrative restaurant empire. The case in Boston, though, this is the first time that he has been criminally charged. Trace? David Lee Miller, live for us in New York. David Lee, thank you.